Right, okay, thank you, Holly. So this is the 5th of November. Remember, remember. Uh, I've just pulled some cards for the moving forward with... Um, so it's just, just our business, you know, just moving forward generally, really. Uh, after the dark moon. So I pulled from the Llewellyn Tarot and also the Gospel of Aradia. So what I got, it's quite astounding actually, so this is amazing, amazing cards. So Eight of Pentacles, which is, I mean just looking at the card you can see yeah, that this craftsperson is busy. They've created many creations and they're very content in their work. You've only got to look at the animals around them. The atmosphere around this person is very content. So there's, you know, there's an abundance of... Um, work from a better word of creation but there's a contentment there as well so very much um yeah the, the actual flow of abundance which is like an unrestricted river so it doesn't there, there aren't huge peaks and troughs it's actually more of a Form of a bit of a flat line of abundance, yeah. <clears throat> King of Pentacles, so two pentacles, that's not bad actually. So, King of Pentacles, so by being in your sovereignty, by stepping into your leadership role, so whatever that means for you this becomes a reality yeah so by stepping forward with integrity with honor you know from your place of truth <laughs> yeah uh, this becomes a reality and then you bring in the celebration the celebration of you know, being this amazing uh, way shower, trailblazer, which, <laughs> I love these cards, which comes from recognizing, realizing, uh, acknowledging your power. Your power, in this case, if you are a witch, your power as a witch, your power as uh, a light being, your power as a soul, your power as a sovereign being. Yeah. But that involves embracing your shadow or integrating your shadow, however you want to see that. And what's interesting, when I read in the book that comes with these cards, this beautiful book actually that comes with these cards, it talks about the shadow, you know, the not all shadows are negative there are aspects of your soul of the shadow in your soul which are actually very positive and can help you so just bear that in mind when you are doing shadow work <laughs> so yeah <coughs> amazing cards pulled today so this constant stream of abundance in everything comes from stepping forward into your role as a leader, coming from your truth, by knowing your power, recognizing, embracing your shadow. And celebrating that. So 
Then there you go.